Hey, good morning. Today we are at SGSCC Disability and we are about to visit one of our long-standing customers uh, who's purchased our system a couple of years ago. I'm Shereen, one of the client managers, and we're about to go speak to Angela. Hey Angela, thank you for participating in this case study. We appreciate your time. Can you please tell me about St George Sutherland uh, Community College? What services you provide, the values you operate under? Sure. So SGSCC Disability is a, is a day program for adults with disabilities and we support just over 130 clients and we have 100 staff so it's quite a large, um, quite a large service. We operate through the St George and Sutherland Community College which is really great because we have our department, the disability department, as well as five other arms of the community college and um, it's beneficial for the community as a whole to have our, our activities happening on the college site here as well as the other activities for other departments. We've got a work skills RTO and uh, English school age leisure departments. It's a really um, good community feel and our clients have a ball here. <laughs> um, so our, our college mission is enriching lives and I feel like that we absolutely do that across the board for all our departments in the college. Um, and our values are passion and creativity, respect and empowerment and integrity. So those are the, the values that our disability department work, work under. Uh, could you tell me when did you become aware of the iPlanet system and when did you take it on board? So we, we um, discovered the iPlanet system at an NDS annual conference and I think it must have been about three or four years ago um, we saw it set up. At that point in time we were doing everything um, in a paper based system which was onerous and uh, very, very time consuming um, and we were really, really conscious that the NDIS was looming and that we really needed to get something that would pose um, an efficient process, lots of efficiencies that, that um, we were looking for. Um, we took it on board, I think we, we looked at five or six different systems, so we got quite a number of people to come and um, talk through what we currently do and how it might apply, and we really felt like iPlanet was the best of those that we viewed. Um, we took quite a long time to make the decision to take it on board, and I think um, you know, we wanted to really make sure that it was going to meet our needs and be configurable to what we needed um, rather than um, an off-the-shelf off the sort of um, solution that, um, you know, we had to fit into. So um, the explanations that we had from all the different services, we looked at what we currently do and what we felt like we would need to do and iPlanet by far stood out um, ahead of the pack with all of the others. Uh, as you mentioned that you wanted to move away from the paper-based system, what other things would you did you want to solve at that time? Um, I mean obviously the paper-based system was uh, doing my head in from a number of different uh, perspectives. The paper was just out of control but, um, but also uh, the timeliness of reporting, being able to draw reports out really easily, that was something that we needed to have um, in a really efficient manner. Um, consistency across the board in terms of data collection and capturing the day-to-day the -day information about our clients. Um, in a paper-based system that's very time-consuming, lots of different literacy levels of our staff, lots of different um, capabilities and, and lots of inconsistencies around um, planning and goal setting for our clients and, and having iPlanet come on board, it, it gave a more consistent approach to that communication and it also meant that our staff had immediate um, conversation with the people that they needed to have communication with. Um, the reporting is just fantastic, being able to pull out a report as soon as someone calls us and says they've got their NDIA planning meeting, I need a report on this, I need a report on that, we can do it at the touch of a button. Um, those sorts of issues around efficiencies were um, absolutely what we were looking for. Uh, so would you say that iPlanet uh, CRM software has met the needs for St George and Sutherland Community College? Yeah, definitely it's met our needs. I think it's probably exceeded our needs in some ways. Um, there's things in it that we didn't know we needed until we got it on board. Um, we've had the, the calendar function to to claim the funds through NDIS portal has just I, I was originally the person doing it manually for each client and it took me all day to figure out 
what needed to be claimed, what codes, what item numbers, how many hours. There were so many ways that I could have done it incorrectly. This way through the calendar, it's really efficient. It doesn't have any mistakes. It just goes through and it's always perfect. So that part of it has been absolutely outstanding. <laughs> With our 130 clients, I, I think it would take me all week to claim manually if I was doing it that way. Um, but apart from the claiming, I think the reporting, the the reporting functionalities that it has, the different aspects that we can draw out information, lots of different ways to draw out different parts of information. So there's, if, there, if there's something quite specific that we need, we can draw it out quite easily. We don't have to trawl through pages and pages of paper and boxes of information and um, it's all there. So it's definitely met our needs. I think it's, um, we're really excited with the incident management module that's come on board. I think that's going to exceed our expectations as well. I've had a a little bit of a play with it so far which is very exciting um, and just the efficiencies that that poses in terms of um, our audit response our um, reporting to the board about incidents at the moment we're counting them up and doing tele charts very laborious now I can just touch a button and that report comes out and tells us how many reports uh, how many incidents there are of, of each nature and that's going to be fantastic great uh, so how do you find Asperico as a company to work with <laughs> Uh, it's been fantastic. Our journey with Aspirico has been wonderful. We've had, I've had the opportunity to, to actually meet um, Declan Kelly twice, which has been fantastic. It's not often that little old Sutherland Shire Day program gets to meet the, the director of a company, an international company, but um, it, it's been fantastic. I feel like the communication, um, I've always had a really good relationship with our customer relationship managers. Um, and I've always felt like if we have a problem, we get a response really quickly. Um, you know, the, the training when we first implemented the program was great. Lots of face-to-face -face time, lots of opportunity to ask questions and to customize specifically to our requests, which is really, really, was really, really vital for us in order to move forward with a, with a client management system. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess having the relationship manager here on the, on the ground with us, Shireen, it's been fantastic. Um, you know, our ability to pick up the phone, flick through an email and that information gets acted on really quickly. It's fantastic. So you mentioned the incident management module which you recently, uh, St George's Sutherland Community College uh, has taken on board. Mm -hmm. um, can you describe why you made this decision and what made you uh, purchase this module? Yeah, so um, again we continued with a paper-based um, system for our incident management. Now um, our office area has quite a number of um, desks and the process with our paper-based system it really had quite poten a lot of potential for some confidential information to be uh, going awry leaving a, an incident report on someone's desk and then they're not in the next day and there's confidential information sitting there just yeah made my head spin so I um, noticed that you had this incident um, management module that was coming through and got really excited because I felt I feel like it's um, a really great opportunity to keep that confidentiality around incident management um, the tracking the immediacy of reporting the way that um, it's a simplified method of getting all the information in one place I think it's really um, user friendly for the staff who are you know doing 500 things at the end of the day and it's a really quick way of just quickly documenting what happened and the follow-up is um is ready and for immediately for the people who need to do the follow-up um i also really like the way that you can pull out reports i think i mentioned that's the thing that probably gets me most excited is seeing all the different types of reports the way i can configure the reports and make sure that those reports are um, giving us the information that we need for our board for our audit reporting um, and just generally tracking it. Um, I think, you know, I feel like at the moment the incident reporting response in the administration is quite a, a um, big task and not because we have a lot of incidents, because the process that we have had in place is quite convoluted and has lots of touch points where lots of people have to um, interact with that incident report. Um, and this way we can all be doing our part of the incident reporting uh, simultaneously and then you know the incident gets managed and finalized quickly more 
efficiently and quicker than it has done in the past, which is very exciting. Uh, so you've been working with your client manager on the personalization and configuration of the software. Uh, can you tell us how this project has unfolded? Um, it's been fantastic because, I mean, we, we did choose to take the, um, the, the template and then customize as we needed to, but I feel like really the template pretty much met our needs as it was. There's been just, um, you know, a couple of tweaks in terms of language, um, you know, certain things that we don't provide, but other alternatives that we do. So we've been able to just quickly email backwards and forwards. Can we change this word to that? Or can we, you know, move this to there? Or And though all of those things have been acted on really quickly. Um, great communication. Um, I really like the cap sheet um, process where we can communicate the changes so that it's really clear there's, there's just no sort of room for it to go wrong in terms of interpretation of what's been said. It's all documented and dated and, and that information flows really well. So um, I found the um, customization to be really, really excellent, a really, really beneficial part for us to, um, to make sure that it works for us and meets our needs. Do you think you have any further iPlanet project planned for the upcoming future uh, in regards to maybe the pl uh, participant portal access? Yeah, absolutely. So um, when we first got iPlanet, we really, a, a big part of it that I got really excited about was the fact that the clients had their own portal access and that they were able to view their calendars and information and things from, from their side. Um, <clears throat> we had great ambitions of getting that rolled out pretty much immediately um, but we did find that the change management for our staff took a little bit of time and and I would really encourage anyone taking it on board to acknowledge that that does take some time make sure you plan for that changeover um, people sometimes new technology can be a little bit daunting um, but across the board the change the change process um, is, is something that you really need to invest some time into um, for the benefits of getting great outcomes later on. We've got a small handful of families who are and clients who are really excited about getting the client view going and of iPlanets going so they um, we're working with them at the moment and I've got it on my plan to have everyone um, on board and rolled out by June of next year. So this time next year we'll have all clients on their, on their iPlanet profiles, um, all the staff, the incident management, it's going to be fantastic. <laughs> Great, thank you so much for your time today. We really, really appreciate uh, you participating in the case study. Uh, we look forward to working with you, uh, configuring your incident management and assisting you with uh, your client portal access rollout. Thank you, Angela. Thank you.